Welcome back. It's time for a spicy and unique flavored cauliflower raw curry. I assure you, it is different from all other Indian curries. Let's get started. For making this you need, a cup of small onion. And for masala, take ginger, garlic that are finely chopped and some fenugreek seeds, cloves and cinnamon. For spicinus take some red chilies. I am using normal red chilies, if are using Kashmiri ones add 4 to 5. And as usual for cooking, take mustard, large onions and finally coriander leaves. Oh, it is cauliflower curry, so take one cauliflower. Broke them into pieces. They should be in medium size. Take those pieces in a vessel, add some water, so that the water fully covers the pieces and bring the cauliflower pieces to a boil, and remove the water using strainer. First let's make the raw masala, note that this is the key ingredient for this recipe. Take a mixer jar, add the ginger and garlic pieces that are finely chopped. Then add small onions, these onions gives our curry a unique flavor and finally our Indian spices, fenugreek, cinnamon and cloves. Grind them into a thin paste. Don't worry about the rawness of onions, we are going to cook this paste too. If you like our content, please consider subscribing our channel. Now let's start cooking, place a pan in the stove. I am here using a non-stick to a. If you are using aluminum vessel cook this dish in low flame. Add few tablespoons of oil, for the gravies like this, you can add any vegetable oil. From here it's normal cooking steps, once mustard cracks add onion pieces and red chili. We used to add salt initially to the onion, because salt ensures that the onion is well cooked without burning. And not only for this dish, for all dishes roast the onions until golden it lowers the sweetness of onion. Once the onion gets light golden, add turmeric powder. Turmeric powder not only adds color to our dishes, but it is also good for its antimicrobial properties and health benefits. After mixing the turmeric powder with onion, now add garam masala. It is added to boost the spices in the dish. If you don't like to add garam masala, you can increase the amount of spices we greened it earlier. Oh, I also forget to mention tomato in ingredients. But no worries, everyone is it at home. So add one tomato that is cut into four pieces and cook it until the skin of tomato gets soft. It is better to close the tawa with lid, to make it cook fast. As the tomato has softened, it's the time to add your boiled cauliflowers to it, and mix it well. Oh, as my tawa is small, cauliflower jumps out and it is difficult to mix, so use a big tawa to avoid spilling. Make sure to mix the tomato and cauliflower nicely. And finally, it's the time to add your magic. That is our green good masala paste. This paste is what makes our curry very tasty and unique. No more worries, it's the final step, add some coriander leaves and salt as per taste. Close it with a lid and cook it for a few more minutes. If you wish you can add some more water to make the curry thin. Hola, our tasty cauliflower raw curry is ready. Not only its name this recipe is amazing. Try this in your home and comment your results below. Today I am serving this with chapati, which is a very good combination. And it's the time to say bye. See you in the next video. Comment what Indian recipes you want to see next next. Take care. It's Indian cook shining off. <laughs>